Ampere. The Ampere, often shortened to AMP, is the SI unit of electric current and is one of the seven SI base units. It is named after André Marie Ampère, French mathematician and physicist, considered the father of electrodynamics. In practical terms, the Ampère is a measure of the amount of electric charge passing a point in an electric circuit per unit time, with 6.241 x1018 electrons, or 1 coulomb, per second constituting 1 Ampère. The practical definition may lead to confusion with the definition of the coulomb, that is, 1 ampere second, and the ampere hour, AH, but amperes can be viewed as measuring a flow rate, the number of charged particles transiting per unit time, and coulombs simply as an amount, the total number of particles. Definition Ampere's force law states that there is an attractive or repulsive force between two parallel wires carrying an electric current. This force is used in the formal definition of the ampere, which states that it is the constant current that will produce an attractive force of 2x10-7 newton per meter of length between two straight, parallel conductors of infinite length and negligible circular cross-section placed one meter apart in a vacuum. The SI unit of charge, the coulomb, is the quantity of electricity carried in one second by a current of one ampere. Conversely, a current of one ampere is one coulomb of charge going past a given point per second. In general, charge Q is determined by steady current I flowing for a time T as Q equals it. History The ampere was originally defined as one-tenth of the CGS system electromagnetic unit of current, now known as the abampere. The amount of current that generates a force of 2 dynes per centimeter of length between two wires 1 centimeter apart. The size of the unit was chosen so that the units derived from it in the MKSA system would be conveniently sized. The International Ampere was an early realization of the ampere, defined as the current that would deposit 0.00111800 grams of silver per second from a silver nitrate solution. Later, more accurate measurements revealed that this current is 0.99985A. Realization The standard ampere is most accurately realized using a watt balance, but is in practice maintained via Ohm's law from the units of electromotive force and resistance, the volt and the ohm, since the latter two can be tied to physical phenomena that are relatively easy to reproduce, the Josephson junction and the quantum Hall effect, respectively. At present, techniques to establish the realization of an ampere have a relative uncertainty of approximately a few parts in 107, and involve realizations of the watt, the ohm and the volt. Proposed future definition Rather than a definition in terms of the force between two current carrying wires, it has been proposed to define the ampere in terms of the rate of flow of elementary charges. Since a coulomb is approximately equal to 6.241509 3x1018 elementary charges, such as electrons, 1 ampere is approximately equivalent to 6.241509 3x1018 elementary charges moving past a boundary in one second, or the reciprocal of the value of the elementary charges in coulombs. The proposed change would define 1A as being the current in the direction of flow of a particular number of elementary charges per second. In 2005, the International Committee for Weights and Measures CIPM, agreed to study the proposed change. The new definition is expected to be formally proposed at the 25th General Conference on Weights and Measures CGPM, in 2014. Everyday Examples the current drawn by typical constant voltage energy distribution systems is usually dictated by the power, watts, consumed by the system and the operating voltage. For this reason the examples given below are grouped by voltage level. Portable gadgets Hearing aid, typically 1 MW at 1.4 V, 0.7 MA. Motor vehicles, 12 VDC a typical motor vehicle has a 12V battery. The various accessories that are powered by the battery might include Instrument panel light, typically 2W, 166 MA 
headlights, typically 60W, 5A each, starter motor, typically 1 to 2 kilowatts, 80 to 160A. North American domestic supply, 120 VAC. Most United States, Canada and Mexico domestic power suppliers run at 120V. Household circuit breakers typically provide a maximum of 15A or 20A of current to a given set of outlets. 22-inch slash 56cm portable television, 35W, 290 MA, tungsten light bulb, 60 to 100 watts, 500 to 830 MA, toaster, kettle, 2 kilowatts, 16.6A, immersion heater, 4.6 kilowatts. 38.3 A. European and Commonwealth domestic supply, 230-240 VAC. Most European domestic power supplies run at 230V, and most Commonwealth domestic power supplies run at 240V. For the same amount of power, in watts, the current drawn by a particular European or Commonwealth appliance, in Europe or a Commonwealth country, will be less than for an equivalent North American appliance. Typical circuit breakers will provide 16A. The current drawn by a number of typical appliances are 22-inch slash 56-cm portable television, 35W, 145-150 MA, tungsten light bulb, 60-100 to watts, 240-450 MA, compact fluorescent lamp, 11 to 30W, 56 to 112 megaampers, toaster, kettle, 2 kilowatts, 9A, immersion heater, 4.6 kilowatts, 19 to 20A.